Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Wild Arms. I'm your host, Sages, filling in for White Mage Premier today. He's out ill, and I'm gonna ha take you through the next part of Wild Arms here. So let's head on over here to the right and come into the library here. Good timing, I know you'll help me out. I was sorting the books out, and I ended up making a mess. I'm terrible at this. Anji the Magician has a magical p pocket watch. Please, Cecilia, get the watch from Anji and help me clean the library. The watch will reverse time and put all the books back on the shelves. Well, that's pretty self-explanatory. we got to find Anji now. But before we do anything else, come over here and talk to the teacher here. You'll get a crest graph, which is used in making spells. Always useful to have around, eh? Now, now get that, and we'll make our own spell later on. But for now, we need to find Anji. And run! Time to walk. Okay. Now come over here and come up the steps here. And here we are, here's Anji. Good timing, please take a look. Ooh, pretty stone. This is a guardian stone. This is a guardian stone. It responds to the power of the guardians. According to my studies, the teardrop has the connection to him, has some connection to him. Push the tool button near the desk and use the teardrop. Now we're going to learn about Cecilia's tool here, and that would be the teardrop. It responds to magical forces, basically. If there's a sealed door, you should use it there. Well, let's see here. Oh, look, it reacted. How about that? <laughs> Just as I thought, there's a definite reaction. Where teardrop crystal and the guardians are linked in some way. A teardrop is a secret treasure of the Alde uh, Aldehyde family. That's why the stone glowed. This will help so much in furthering my research. You can have my pocket watch. It's very useful. Now you have your walk pocket. Ooh, present. You got your pocket watch. Congrats. Now you can reverse time. By using the pocket watch, you can go back in time. You can reconstruct bo broken boxes, reset objects that are stuck in place. It may not always be effective, but magic is, uh, is magic. Uh, but it's magic is worth repeating. Okay. <laughs> and now we head back to the kitchen library and fix up the little mess he made. Run! Oh, my god. Run! And... Here he is. So that's Angie's watch. Please, you fix, this, fix up this mess. I'll go to Sister... Oh, over to Sister Mary and, and make some excuses. I'll be right back. Cecilia, I'm counting on you, okay? Now we get the reverse time. I hate to use magic for a purpose like this, but... Whee! Now we do a time warp. Flux capacitor time. Go! Okay. Wow, this thing really works. Huh? There's one book still left on the floor. Oh, oh God. Innocent one. Release. Let go of your ego. I am trapped within the sealed library. You see, when a book starts talking to you, that's a bad sign. A book spoke to me, the same voice as in the dream. What is a sealed library? I wonder if it's located somewhere in the obby. Well, why not go ask Sister Mary? She is everything, I'm sure. Run! Run! Okay, and I totally missed her. Oh. Let's go over here and ask Sister, uh, Sister Mary. <laughs> so a book is calling you to the sealed library. Yes, it's not a dream. The shadow spoke to me and asked me to release him from the book. Sister Mary, I thought you might know. A book which speaks of in a large shadow. A library in which many forbidden secrets are stored does exist. Where the sealed library is, I cannot tell you. You are summoned by the guardians to search for the sealed library. You are the chosen one. You must do this on your own. Oh, much help you are. Okay. Now we have to go around and ask all the people about the sealed library. First come over here to this kid here. 
There's something strange about this courtyard. For some, the two statues seem to become as light as a feather. For others, they seem to have they are as heavy as a mountain. Something about these statues are really spooky. Oh, well, that's interesting. Come over here and talk to this little girl. I don't know about any secret, any sealed library, but I do know about the two statues in the courtyard that have secret switches. If you want to push, I want to push them so bad. Great. Yeah, you learn a bit more about making magic. Go over here and talk to the magician here. This is magic heal. You can summon simple magic. Try it. Okay, let's try binding. Okay, let's try... Okay, now let's use one crest and... Now there are, of course, different elements which you can make. Reflect black, uh, back magic ally. Increase encounter rate. And, of course, recover. So let's increase ally defense and make shield. Please rename this spell. I ah, will leave it shield for now. Shield hit was completed. And now we've made our first spell. Just a basic idea of how you do it. I'm not really all that in depth with it. Okay, now come up here. Come over here and talk to Lila, who's sick in bed. How ironic is that? I'm not the only one who knows this. The secret sealed library is a popular rumor around here. Something acts as a key to open the door or something. Hint, hint. Okay. Now we go to the courtyard. Fairly base. Basic and, uh, not that hard to do. <laughs> Run! Okay. Run! Run to wall. Okay. We'll come over here to the courtyard. Now these statues, they need to face. They need to be switched, basically. First switch done, and that one's not going to be easy. Oh god. Okay. Next switch done, and now you use your teardrop. Right here, guys. Oop. Ooh, shiny. I guess we follow him. That means one thing and one thing only. Run! Alright. I am the internal darkness. Come to me, innocent one. Bring me your inner light. And now you just use your teardrop here. And whoosh, away we go. Yeah, this is pretty simple. We're in the first dungeon for the first seal, and... So, up oh, sealed door. Whatever will we do? A blue crystal similar to the teardrop crystal is embedded in the door. Hmm. Oh, look at that. Okay, now come over here. There's a switch right there, and you it. And now we hit on it. Oh, Fun indeed. Yep. Only a book. Only a blue book. <laughs> so this attack, it should kill it. Oh, it's dead. Moving on! Whee! Oh, two treasure chests. Is he just getting those? But first... No box at that crystal over there, and it should open the door. Medicine acquired. And magic carrot acquired. Woohoo, we got a magic carrot. And now we head on to the library over here. Run! Ow. Boxes, damn you. Into my chest. Oh, dang it. Okay. We need to use one of the boxes here. First, come over here to the switch. 
reach over here and throw the box around. There we go, next door open. Oh, all the chests are empty. And it looks like we're about out of time, guys. Thanks for joining me, and hopefully White Mishrenia will back, be back here to show you the ropes in the next part of Wild Arms. Thanks for watching. See you later.